In this presentation, I am going to explain what is third world. The term third world arose during the Cold War to define countries that remained non-aligned with either NATO or the Warsaw Pact. And normally these countries were defined by high poverty rates, lack of resources and unstable financial standing. Most of the third world countries were included countries with colonial pasts in Africa, Latin America, Oceania and Asia. It was also sometimes taken as synonymous with countries in the non-aligned movement. Many of third world countries were faced with the challenges of nation and institution building on their own for the first time. Due to this common background, many of these nations were developing in economic terms and many of those countries still are developing. During the Cold War, two groups emerged on the world stage. One group was Western countries led by the United States along with its allies Canada, Japan, South Korea and other Western European states represented the first world. The second group of countries led by the Soviet Union along with its allies China, Cuba, North Korea, Vietnam etc. represent the second world. At the same time, there was a third group of countries that were non-aligned with either of first world or second world called the third world. Here on the map we can see countries in blue color representing the first world and countries in red color are representing the second world and countries in green representing the third world countries and the third world countries also known as non-aligned countries. Important points about third world countries since the fall of Soviet Union and the end of Cold War, the term third world has decreased in use. However, few people relate the third world only to the economic situation of the country. For example, any poor country was being related to a third world country. The term third world became a stereotype to refer to developing countries as third world countries. However, Historically, some European countries were also non-aligned and a few of these were and still are very prosperous including Austria, Finland, Ireland, Sweden and Switzerland. The concept of the third world has now become outdated because it no longer represents the current political or economic state of the world. That's it for now. We will come back with a different topic. Till then, keep watching Narvi Academy.